Hi, this is Tom from Skewworks with my latest side project, a full PC based on the uh, NetMF, .NET Micro Framework standard. Uh, this is using a Fez Cobra from GHI Electronics with uh, a USB keyboard. We start off, it's got a program called Retro Console running that allows me to, to type into it and process commands. And it has basically all of the same commands as you would have seen in DOS as well as um, Wi-Fi support and the ability to run SBasic scripts, uh, Skewworks application standard apps, and regular full .NET micro framework applications. So what we're going to do here is we're going to show off a couple of things uh, using that. We're going to go over to the samples directory and run an SBasic script. Uh, the basic script we're going to run here is test.bas and uh, just like DOS, this is going to know what current directory we are in and if it doesn't find a command that matches what I've entered, it's going to see if there's a uh, executable that matches it. In this case, test.bas. And uh, right now it's going to load that up, parse it all out, and uh, process it. When it's done, it'll report back with uh, the exit code. Now this is a uh, very simple .NET micro framework application called Colored Lights and all it does is it uh, creates a bitmap the same size as the screen and flashes it with random colors for 10 seconds. While this is running, um, the PC has no control at all. It has to wait until the application has terminated. With a Skewrix application standard application, it would be able to uh, work with it, interrupt it, switch between applications, things like that. Now in addition to these, we've also got the ability to uh, hex view. And it will automatically break every full screen and uh, request that you enter a key before continuing. You can do a control C to cancel, just like in DOS. And you can do a print as well, which is the, uh, the full text. Um. And again, it automatically breaks and you can do a control C. It even has upkey for last command, like in DOS. <clears throat> and while the uh, command set is fairly limited, you can do copy, move, rename, delete, uh, things like that. Everything can be expanded because you can use not only SBasic, but full .NET Micro Framework, as well as the Skewworks application standard. I hope you enjoyed it.